describing how his mum often used to say, you have to be strong like the Rock of Gibraltar. Maxi Priest says that he knew from the first moment he visited Gibraltar was a place he'd come back to. It's clear he feels a special bond with the country. Because as a, as a kid we would hold on to that saying, it, it, even though we didn't understand the whole full story of it, it just made sense. You know, or it sounded good. You gotta be strong like the Rock of Gibraltar. So we're kind of like, Rock of Gibraltar must be solid, you know. Coming here and then feeling the vibe from the people when we did the concert here, the energy and the love and all of that, walking down Main Street and, you know, people coming out and saying hi and telling me all these different stories about uh, when they used to play my music and um, driving around the island when you guys were locked off from uh, Spain. Um, I kept singing um, the song uh, during the time I was here for the concert. And, Crucial Steve kept saying to me um, that I should um, do a song about it. You're going to be celebrating your birthday here next month at the concert in St Michael's Cave. Tell us a bit about that. Uh, the first time I came here they took us to the cave and I remember walking in there and going, wow. It just lends itself to a concert. St Michael's Cave is a unique and unusual venue. What's the strangest place that you've ever performed? There's been so many places, but this is one of those places that will, will stay with me for a long time. What's your favourite thing about performing? Performing and, and, and actually um, feeling the response from, from the audience, you know. Where's your inspiration come from? As a kid, you know, I, I started off in church and at home. You know, we would always sing, my mother would sing, my brothers and sisters would sing. We would sing at church in the choir. Um, and I just loved the art of singing. And that in itself, with respect to all genres of music, just kind of opens itself up for me to, to sing anything and everything. I guess my appreciation for different genres of music has created the style of singing that I have today. Maxie's birthday concert will take place on the 10th of June. Tickets can be purchased at John McIntosh Hall. It's sure to be an incredible evening and they'll be doing some filming for his new music video should you wish to make an appearance.